Hello, this is Kensley from Kensley Design. Today we are going to be learning how to convert a normal JPEG picture into a correct draw C at D5. Without waste of our time, maybe some of you may like to maybe get a picture. You have a particular picture. Okay, you love this picture. You would like to do some editing effect on this picture and you'll be like how am i going to start doing this so, yeah i'm going to be showing you how to go on with that in just few clicks all right let's begin first of all i'm going to let me get the picture i want to use as the jpeg uh, image file that i want to use to convert to corridor file i'm going to import can either press my control i to import all right just get trying to get a picture i can work on okay let me see, let me see. One, two, layers. Okay, let me take one out of these two. Let me see the boot. Alright. Mm, I guess I'm going to go with this one. I'll go with this one. That will do away with this. Okay, as you can see, this is a normal JPEG picture. You can see I can apply any color on it. You can see I can't apply any color on this particular this because it is a JPEG picture. Okay, right now we are going to go straight into the conversion. In doing this, I'm using corridor x7 corridor version x7 so i'm going to go into going to edit bitmap all right taking a longer to go I'm going to go to bitmap I'll click on this is quick trace I'm going to make use of my outline trace then I'll now go to line trace watch line trace clicking on this is going to bring out this particular page for me sorry there are some other features hidden below here you can see this is my original image how it looks like and this is my final trace the trace after the line tracing this is how it looks like this is line tracing I'm going to make it I think the settings this settings is actually okay for me I'm okay with that okay I'm going to sorry I have to just turn my screen resolution so that you can see what is I was saying that is actually below this part. Sorry, turning the other way around. All right, this is okay. This is where I'm going to click on. I'll hit on the OK. Guess you can see this is where. Okay, is so I'm going to click on OK. So I click on OK. The effects. Let me return it mode. All right. I clicked on OK, and it finished the editing stuff. Now you can now see I now have. To image this particular image is the original JPEG image. Why this is the one I've 
trimmed i've edited and done trace on so now you can see it is grouped this particular work is grouped so i'm going to ungroup it I can either come here or come to objects when i come to objects this is group then i will do ungroup all just going to ungroup all of them so you cannot see in this particular work and i have everything separated you cannot see the colors are all separate so i can start giving it any color i wish I can give any part any color let me say i wish to give this blue you can see it i can give any color i wish to any of the shape there all right i guess you've learned how to easily convert a jpeg picture into this is the whole line out of everything you can see that's the whole line art all right i'm done with this hope you've learned a lot from this particular tutorial in case you like encourage me by hitting on the subscribe button like and share this particular videos you can also visit my blog on www.kingspet I mean sorry www.crownexplicit.com you go to the tutorial section you can get more tutorials from video tutorials from that particular blog also you can drop me a message ask any question you want to ask and i promise i'll be ready to answer you until next time bye for now